How is it going everybody? Today is a big day. I wanted to give you a little sneak peek of what we got coming up because your boy, he's got, he's got connections. Worldwide, international, interstellar, I've got connections all over the goddamn place. And today I got a shipment coming all the way from Japan, from my boy Jimmy, who hooked me up with a bunch of snacks that I'm gonna be trying. The box is technically opened because I wanted to get, he fucking wrote really big everybody's addresses and shit. So I just wanted to get that off of there, but I haven't really gone through it. I can see a couple Japanese words, but since I can't read Japanese, I don't feel as though I've cheated you out of the experience of opening this with me. I gotta do this kind of quick because I don't know how much storage I have on my phone. We're not tasting today, so these will be showing up in my shorts in the next few weeks. I don't know how many things are in here, but in the next while, it's all gonna be Japanese food. If you wanna see them, like and subscribe. If you think I'm handsome, like and subscribe. If you like Robert Frost, you can keep stepping. We don't fuck with Robert Frost around here. Fuck Robert Frost. All right, let's get into it. Corn potage. I had a corn stick last time and there's a video of me eating it. Uh, I don't really know what potage means. I think, I thought it meant, I feel like it means potato, but I don't know if that's true. Potage, potato, potato, potato. I look fucking bald right now, huh? I, fucking corn potage, number one. Number two, coming in hot. We got aerial beef. That looks like a for sure. So I'm gonna assume it's either it's either beef or yeah. flavored. I don't know which one. Oh, it's gotta be the steak in the top. So it tastes like steak, looks like a yeah. I'm sure it's gonna be great. Next up, we're just moving right along. We got Looks like I'm gonna go ahead and guess pizza potato chips. I tried some pizza potato chips not that long ago. They didn't really taste like pizza. Curious to see if these guys do it better. These are my boys over at Calby. Look, it looks like there's like, like a stick of butter got way too excited all over this potato chip. You know what, I'm gonna cut all, <laughs> cut all. Pizza potato chips. Again, I'm not even gonna try and pronounce that. Twist, I guess I am gonna try and pronounce it. Twist Teok Boki. I'm guessing some kind of barbecue chip. Looks pretty good, I'm not gonna lie, I like the the color, I think the, the packaging is very nice. Uh, I like the fork in the hot dog up there. Maybe they're hot dog flavored. There's like a picture of something down there that I don't know what it is. We're gonna find out together later this week. I guess it's gonna be lemon flavored chips, which is an interesting flavor combo. Uh, hmm. I feel like there's a pun here. Lemon chip, no, I guess not. I guess there's, there's not really a pun there. Okay, anyway, lemon chips. After that, ramen flavored something. Maybe those are like dry, you ever, you know when you do the poor people thing and you take the dry ramen noodles, you spice it and then you eat it like chips. Maybe that's similar to this because if you look up in the top corner there, that's kind of what it looks like. Ramen flavored. And that's what I'm gonna guess it is. I'm gonna guess it's broken up ramen or something along those lines. Don't get scared. There's a motherfucking ghost in this box. We have these ghostly chips that appear to be on some kind of sale, so that's cool. Always, always try to get them deals, Jimmy. Always try to get those fucking deals. I think they're egg flavored, which is kind of cool. Soft boiled egg flavored chips. I, I fucking like that. That's, I can fuck with that. Gaming flavored cup of noodles. I'm gonna go ahead and guess they taste like Mountain Dew or Cheetos. And the only way to properly prepare them is it looks like you got to use Gamer Girl bath water. So I got to, I'm going to have to invest to fucking get this down, but I'm going to do it. I wonder, did anyone else see the thing that apparently they're going to start putting cup of noodles into paper cups because we weren't supposed to be microwaving the styrofoam cups all these years? We are all gonna die by the age of 50. That's almost fucking guaranteed. Grilled taco Dorito sticks? I can fuck with that. That's, that sounds fucking, that sounds really good. I don't know what else to say about it. They look really good. I think those are called pirouettes normally. However, these ones appear to be sweet potato flavored, which is really fucking cool. Little butter spiral. I think those are sweet potatoes or yams. They gotta be, right? 
Uh, last time there was a lot of fish stuff, and so I'm really glad that there's not a lot of fish flavored things this time. So, Jimmy, even though I love and appreciate you so much, too much fish stuff last time. But this, I don't know, this looks like maybe it's fish of some kind or rice. Like maybe like roe flavored. For those of you who aren't as sophisticated as me, roe is fish eggs. Actually, you know what? If I'm wrong, please feel free to eviscerate me in the comments. In the meantime, Row chips, that's what I'm gonna go with. I'm, gonna, I'm going with row. Uh, these are spicy chicken, same company. Spicy chicken chips. I can fuck with that. That sounds good. All right. And this bag, I'm not gonna lie, I was kind of hoping it was a Japanese 7 Eleven bag, which I just thought would be cool. It looks like a Mar I think it's a Mario chocolate pop. Which, I mean, that's pretty cool. I like that. That's fun. And it didn't melt in transit, which I'm amazed by because uh, this came to me from, this traveled from Japan and then traveled through the U.S. mail system from like Florida. So I'm very surprised that it didn't melt. Apparently they're called Chill Bites. I don't know what they are. They contain flavors of hops, black tea, grapefruit, gummy snack, but I don't know what the, I don't know what the two at the top means. There's just, these are on a scale of one to five and they gave it a two. These are cool. Squishy juice balls of some kind? And I don't even know, is that a pear? I think that's a pear, I think. Or is it an apple? Either way, squishy juice balls. Those are fun. I wonder if these are for children. Maybe that's why they're in a separate bag. Maybe this is kid stuff. I'm eating it all. I'm not giving any of this to my kids, Jimmy. So if that was the plan, don't, don't worry about it. Next we have, oh really? Adorable little mints that I'm, really excited about this packaging is the most relaxing fucking thing i've seen in my entire life so i'm very excited about that and last but not least we got some pokemon fruit snacks it looks like that meme where the chick is sitting on the couch and she has all the guys standing behind her and they're about to do a gangbang and that's what this is that's the vibes that this is giving me right here like pikachu is the innocent little girl and then the three behind are the you know the the gangbangers. Anyone else? No? Just me? Okay. Alright. We did it. You might as well fucking try one of these things. I think the one we're gonna go with, exclusive to the long form content, is these apple juice balls. Apple pear juice balls. Open that up. I would just like to say, ooh, that fucking ooh, that smells really <laughs> that smells wicked good. They are I think they are apple. They are very squishy. Not as liquidy as I thought they would be. They are pear flavored and they even have like, you know how pears have like a little bit of grit? Pretty sure these are pear flavored. And they do have a little bit of grit just like pears do. If they're apple flavored, now I'm wrong. I don't know, they're a little gray. And they also have, I've, and they also have like uh They have like a skin on the outside that is sort of, they have a skin on the outside that's like a different texture when you're eating it. But they are not as juicy as I thought they were gonna be. I thought it was gonna be like a ball with juice in it. It's much more like a gummy snack. I'm gonna edit that to make it look like I got that in the first shot and not in the tenth like I actually did. Stay tuned to see me be eating these. Oh, I gotta give these a rating. These are actually pretty good. I would probably give these like a 7, 7.5. 7.5 out of 10 is pretty good. Guys, I love you. I hope you have a wonderful day. And I uh, will talk to you soon. Fuck, I gotta go. All right, bye.